these are the eight best PlayStation VR 2 games that I've played this year. Zombie shooters are a dime a dozen on VR platforms like PSVR 2 and the MetaQuest 3. And while there's a case to say that the in-depth survival aspects of The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners makes it the best one, the recently released Arizona Sunshine 2 is far less stressful and absolutely nails the simple satisfaction that comes from endlessly mowing down the undead hordes. You'll be hacking, bashing and shooting your way through zombies or Freds, as this ill-fated protagonist calls them, in a bid to find more survivors and a cure. Arizona Sunshine 2 is easily one of the most feature-complete zombie shooters on PlayStation VR 2, outdoing the first with the addition of a dog companion that you can use to solve puzzles, attack flesh eaters and more. If you want to gun down zombies as part of a campy story, this one is it. How much of one person's entire life can you squeeze into a single game? That's exactly the question asked in Goodbye World Games' emotional adventure where time is pushed forward any time you blink. And sure, Before Your Eyes packed a brilliant punch when it first launched on PC a few years ago, but playing through a PlayStation VR 2 headset brings you closer to this heartfelt and sometimes heart-wrenching tale about just how quickly life can pass you by. The PlayStation VR 2's eye-tracking technology makes interacting with these world vignettes all the more engaging than they were before, making a strong case that this version is the definitive way to play. Sorry, Netflix. It's not the most visually stunning game, true, but this is more than made up for by a beautifully pastel art style and an ingenious blinking mechanic that's wrapped up in one of VR's best stories. Part psychedelic rhythm game, part sci-fi brick breaker, as well as being one of the most visually striking PlayStation VR 2 exclusives to release this year, C Smash VRS is also guaranteed to keep you moving. Based on Sega's 2001 arcade classic of a similar name, your goal is to master your squash playing skills amongst the intergalactic scene, using your reach and the environment to knock a ball into several floating blocks to achieve the best time and score. What starts out as a very simple premise actually proves difficult to master, as you're encouraged to shift your weight and move your whole body to predict each bounce and get the best rally possible going. Backed up by an incredible soundtrack of both chill and amped up synth beats, C Smash VRS is like no other PlayStation VR 2 game you'll play this year, and it's only continued to get better with newly added co-op, an infinity mode, and an AI bot to play against. The PlayStation 2's showpiece title at launch was none other than this interquel set within Guerrilla Games' post-post-apocalyptic open-world series, Horizon. Firm you placing you in the shoes of another outsider called Rias, Horizon Call of the Mountain lets you experience these lush environments from an all-new first-person perspective. From chasing down stormbirds with a bow, to having the PSVR 2's headset vibrate immensely as a tall neck passes you by overhead. This Horizon spin-off is still one of the best looking and playing games on the platform. Horizon Call of the Mountain is stacked full of these set-piece moments, being a technical showcase for the platform and true evidence for what's possible in VR when a first-party team is given a good budget and has the time to make something special. At this point, it's unlikely we'll see anything on such a level anytime soon on the PlayStation VR 2 again, but that said, it's a must-play for anyone who picks their headset up. Classic literature? Not really your thing? This VR spin on the novels of legendary sci-fi writer Isaac Asimov might be a good substitute. For all its inspirations from the Foundation books, however, Journey to Foundation plays like a much more straightforward affair, setting you hundreds of years into the future as a member of the Peacekeeping Commission, who must investigate crimes and errors while making tough choices. This more narrative-driven approach does give Journey to Foundation a slower pace compared to a lot of other VR games out there, to the extent that pulling out your blaster can sometimes feel odd. Rather, the game is at its best when you're questioning subjects, exploring spaceships and planets, and using your unique mentalics abilities to read the minds of others and influence them. Simply put, Journey to Foundation is one of the most thoughtful PlayStation VR 2 games out there. Roguelikes are big business in the video game world these days. It makes sense, therefore, that for PlayStation VR 2, it has its own dedicated first-person shooter that adopts to the format. Fortunately for players, this comes in the form of Synapse, an impossibly addictive and polished VR title that challenges you to dive into multiple layers of a person's mind to do battle with his thoughts and the minions within. Synapse's gunplay is some of the best on PlayStation VR 2, fully taking advantage of the controller's haptic feedback capabilities to make you feel every kick and recoil. A fully integrated upgrade system helps every run feel unique too, as you get ever more powerful depending on if you want to play aggressively or defensively. Synapse offers a near-endless amount of re 
screen playability, which is appreciated in a PlayStation VR 2 title like this, hence why it makes our list. If you're seeking something a bit more chill and ethereal, Paper Beast Enhanced Edition released for PlayStation VR 2 this year to once again remind us that a story without words can sometimes be the most powerful. Sure, it's been out for a fair few years now already, way back around the time that the original PSVR headset launched, but this Enhanced Edition looks even better, benefiting greatly from the improved eye tracking and haptic feedback. You play as an unnamed explorer, tasked with following and assisting the titular Paper Beasts throughout a vast desert not too dissimilar to the one seen in Journey. Here, however, you're tasked with keeping them safe and using them to shape the environments around you as needed, with water, rocks, and of course, sand, requiring unique solutions to get around. At only three to four hours in length, Paper Beast Enhanced Edition is an enjoyable descent into the dreamlike. Don't be fooled by the terrible title. The Dark Pictures Switchback VR is actually a successful continuation of the VR Ghost Train Shooter concept that developers Supermassive Games first experimented with back on the first PlayStation VR with Until Dawn Rush of Blood. In this instance, the on-rail shooter is based off of entries into the titular Dark Picture saga, letting PSVR 2 players relive the events of those horror games while aboard a sinister roller coaster. Expect to see familiar frights from Little Hope, Man of Medan, House of Ashes and other games featured across the Dark Pictures anthology. Here though, all are subtly reimagined and tied together as part of a wider story being conducted by the curator. The Dark Pictures Switchback VR isn't one for those who suffer from motion sickness, true, but it's an effective way to enjoy PSVR 2 while seated and incur plenty of scares in the process. So there you have it in terms of my top 8 recommendations for the very best PlayStation VR 2 games that you can play right now. Do you have a PSVR 2 headset? Do you still use it? Or maybe you're hoping that you'll pick one up over the Christmas period. Either way, let me know in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the Mirror Gaming YouTube channel for even more videos like this. Until next time, thank you so much for watching guys, and I will see you in the next one. Whew.